Hey, what's going on, people? Your boy, man, Mike here. And this is a conversation. This is something I really wanted to give a lot of Falcons fans opinion on is, should the Falcons go after Dez Bryant? And these are three reasons why I think they should not go after Dez Bryant. The first reason is obvious, Julio Jones and Muhammad Sanu, okay? Julio Jones is a player that will demand double teams. He's going to demand 80 plus catches a year. That goes without saying. And Muhammad Sanu. Muhammad Sanu as a player at this point of his career compared to a Dez Bryant. Now Dez Bryant is a more talented player than Muhammad Sanu. But at this point in his career Dez Bryant cannot get open. Let's not kid ourselves. He can't get open the way he once did. Muhammad Sanu is a better route runner. He's a lot faster than Dez Bryant. And he can just he can get open better uh, at this point in his career than a Dez Bryant. And Dez Bryant is a slower. He came to lead with limited uh, ability to run every route. He doesn't have that. And in his career, he's slower, you know, due to injuries, his foot injury. And you know, he's just not the same player he once was. No, Dez Bryant, he still has a lot of talent. But you know, you put him on the Atlanta Falcons. I mean. He's a number three because I believe Muhammad Sanu is a much better player than Dez Bryant. That's just my personal opinion, especially when you have a Julio Jones on your thing. I would rather have Muhammad Sanu than Dez Bryant. That's just my personal opinion. And the second reason why I say no, the Falcons do not need Dez Bryant is obviously Dez Bryant's attitude. Dez Bryant has a fucked up attitude. Let's not kid ourselves. He ran himself out of Dallas. His attitude, his unwillingness to take a pay cut on a team that obviously needs help. You ran yourself out of Dallas. You are not the player you once were. Every player has to understand that. Every player has to get that. That when you get up in age, and if you want to win a championship, when the GM and the owner ask you to take a pay cut, um, you supposed to do it. Now, I'm not saying that every player should, you know, give up their money, their hard-earned money, or whatever they feel. But at the same time, you have to understand that you're not once, you're not the player you once were. And that's why I feel that Dez Bryant pretty much doomed himself. He screwed himself. And the Falcons do not need a player with an attitude as Dez Bryant. The third reason why I say he's not coming to Atlanta Falcons is obviously I believe that the Falcons will be drafting a receiver in the draft. Now, you have Muhammad Sanu, quite possibly, with the way his contract is structured uh, in the third year. I do not believe he, it's not a foregone conclusion, you know, that he will be back in Atlanta in his third year. You know, he could restructure the deal where it makes, you know, the team a little bit more, you know, cap friendly for him to stay. But at this point, there's no guarantee that Muhammad Sanu is going to um, take a restructured contract or the Falcons just decide they want to move on. I don't know. But... Uh, those are the reasons why I say that, you know, the Falcons will not go after Dez Bryant. Obviously, the first reason is Julio Jones and Muhammad Sanu. They, make a, they're pretty, they pretty much have a great tandem. Uh, the second reason is, you know, Dez Bryant's attitude. He does not fit the mode of Atlanta Falcons team. And the third reason why is obviously that the Falcons will be drafting a right receiver uh, Preferably one with speed, uh, a lot more speed because the Falcons are, you know, they have guys on the practice squad, Marvin Hall, you know, guys like that on the practice squad that they could, you know, battle for that third position. But, you know, at this point, man, the Falcons do not need a Dez Bryant on their squad. And um, let me know what you guys think, man. Should the Falcons go after Dez Bryant, what are your thoughts? Leave your comments below and please do not forget to hit that subscribe button. You boy Mad Mike is out.